Hi friends, today we are going to see the poem called Cactus. It is written by Jean Joseph Ravrindo. He was born in 1901 in Madagascar. He was died in 1937. He has published several poems which are in French and Malaysian languages. He was called as father of modern literature in his native language. We can see in this poem, Cactus, he describes the struggles of lepers. He compares Cactus with lepers because will see that it does not have fingers. So, we can see lepers also does not have fingers. So, he compares characters to lepers. In first era, he describes the beauty of characters. We can see, he says that characters, uh, he, he says that characters seems like fingerless plants that it, uh, that it has molded fingers. So, he says that characters are not Taken by the grid. We can see in cactus, that is in the, in, in the inner part of the cactus, we can see a water substance which, 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 is, which we can eat the substance. So he says that the cactus feeds the cattle and the tribe who are wandering in the dry place. So he feeds, he feeds all the people. Who, who is in need? Then in next era, he completely compares cactus with lepers. He says that lepers does not have fingers and they are looking at the sky and the nature. They are in the forest. Meanwhile, the people in the cities are experiencing the green grass which are in the cities. But the lepers who are in the forest only if the dark and trees around them in the moonlight. We can say, we can see that the lepers, they lived in caves from ID themselves from the city people. So, the lepers need to climb on the hills. We can see if the goat or bulls are trying to climb, climb the hill, we can see they will feel difficult to climb the, the, climb the hills. So, the lepers also feel difficult to climb the hills. In this, in this way, the compass, lepers and cattle, they are trying hard to climb the hills. They are hiding themselves in caves from the city people. In that era, he says that, he says the rude readers that, he doesn't go and find uh, that from where that the that from that the helper got his sickness because 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 they say that from where they got the sickness because so he says that we should not abuse lepers so so he says that he doesn't go to the place of lepers that they live in the caves he also says that the lepers are filled with nature because the blood of the earth the warm of the wind, he says that we can see the water substance in the air and the wind comes and falls from the hands of lepers and it brings the door of lepers and it replaces the lepers with golden cross. Golden cross, he covers the golden cross with the door of the lepers. We can see cactus, cactus will, cactus will have Flowers. The same way, lepers so will also seem like the, the flowers. So he compares the flower of the lepers as golden cross. He says that lepers are mingled with nature and nature makes them to part the water stream and the substance whatever with nature, it falls on the lepers as well as the people in the cities. And it makes melt the thorns in lepers' hand and it turns into golden glass because it replaces the melted thorn and it gives another new thorn in lepers. And he comes with, with a sad character and a positive note that, that the lepers are replaced by another thorn or another thorn that will give pain to the lepers, but he cuts the sore 
which is in the letters grand as golden cross. So I am going to conclude this poem that as he displays and he pictures how lepers suffered due to their 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 sores in their body, and he would identify them. They marginal, they were marginalized by the people. We can we can see even think that in Jean Joseph's age, then he started with lepers, and they are identified with the people. he says to the people that he says to the people who are in his age he says that lepers are, are not to ask to be identified they are simply considered as a human being so he asked the people to go into the lepers lepers cave and find the difficulties of the lepers and find the origin of the lepers sickness so it is difficult to find the origin of the sickness so Lepers as a human being. This is the moral of the poem characters. And and I say thank you for watching this video. Bye.